distancia mi enemigo. Remain steadfast. Rest in peace. People should realize there is a war going on for their benefit. Well, the sober ones anyway. Who goes there? Salve to you too. Ezio! I was expecting my wife. Somehow that does not surprise me. The French putane have us under pressure. Tell me about their general. 
these Baron de Valois. Cesare persuaded King Louis to lend him an entire army to defeat me. I'm flattered. Where can I find him? It's only a matter of time before I have Valois by the throat. We have them in retreat. They seem to be getting closer. The situation is under control. Close the gate! Benny, so maybe I could use a little help. Bonjour, Général Dalviano. Êtes-vous prêt à vous rendre? Why don't you come closer and say that? You must learn how to speak French. It would mask your barbaric sensibilities. Perhaps you could teach me, and I would instruct you in fighting, since you seem to do so little of it. As amusing as this parley has been, I'd like your unconditional surrender before sunrise. Ha! My Lady Bianca will whisper it in your ear! I believe another lady might object to that. Mio marito vi amazzerà tutti! I'll kill you for tutto francese! Calm down, for your wife's sake. You know my terms. Enter my camp unarmed at dawn. And practice your French. Soon all of Italy will be speaking it. I'll get you, pezzo di merda, figlio di puttana! from this forge at night next day. between your thighs. 
In fact, there is a hole there, so deep it reaches into the maledetto inferno! What good are you to our dead? We will regroup and fight through the gates as we did at the Arsenale. The entrance is thicker with Frenchmen than the streets of Paris. So we will climb the battlements. They cannot be scared. Pantasilea would know what to do. Maybe this is the end. I enter at dawn bearing gifts. And hope that coward spares her life. Perché non ci ho pensato prima? What did I say? Call your men back to the barracks. I will explain there. You better have something good. Fall back! who need aid oh, you should feel better now but take care in future so you have a plan once inside your men can overpower the camp's patrols correct yes but Especially if the patrols are taken completely by surprise. Ma certo. Then we need to liberate several suits of French armor. At dawn, we are going to walk right in. Ah! Ezio Auditore! You are truly a man after my own heart. Oh, magnifico! I will get the armor. My troops will gather it from the dead. We will then depart from the north, so as not to arouse suspicion. And Ezio! Make sure to kill them without a fight. The armor has to stay clean. Kill him! <laughs> 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 
The liberation of Roma has begun. I could have taken them, but grazie. Say, which way are you going? Madonna. Don't. Hasn't he hurt me enough? I will not touch you. What happened here? Auguste, my beloved husband. He believes he owns this neighborhood. The Borgia have given it to him. He once made signs for the shops in the district. But now he posts lies for the Borgia and hurts those who stand in his way. Like you. Where is he? He spends his days locked in his workshop. But I may know how to go them out. Now. Tell down the signs he has posted throughout the district. His pride won't stand for it. Grazie.
Have you been drinking? I'm sure. Where did he go? Ah, from this forge of nightmare. We need to think of ways to strike the... Milano has nothing on me. I have the sharpest clothes of all. Next time, then.
We run an honest business. Till next time, arrivederci messere! Don't listen to those so-called experts, extorting the virtues of Botticelli. Please, you'll be forgotten in ten Sorry! Years. I meant to disrespect! Matters! Fundamentals, good people! Who has been tearing down my sides? I want him dead! Requiescat in pace.
The liberation of Roma has begun. Oh, that was close. Grazie. Would you teach me to fight these vermin as you do? Are you proud to wear those? Don't stand up too fast. We gonna get any food in here? 
People who don't work, don't eat. I'm kidding. You knew I was kidding, right? Right. Smile and nod. Someone just volunteered to get the food. It was worth it. What happened to Katerina Sforza? She went back to Florence and petitioned unsuccessfully for the return of her lands. Then she died of pneumonia. That's sad. That's life. Well, that's death, technically, but you take my point. How's the power situation? It's okay for now, but the power lines are from the Stone Age. Bloody third world country! You're talking about Italy. No, Europe in general. I didn't know England was a third world country. England is not in Europe, actually, Rebecca. We, we tolerate Europe, you know? Like, like a person tolerates herpes. Sometimes I feel so disconnected from everything out there. Nearly a decade of my life gone, searching for those pieces of Eden. Think how great you'll feel when we finally stop the Templars. I'm not sure it will ever end, Desmond. I can't do this forever. I don't buy it. But Lucy I know brought me here and taught me how to see. She would never give up. <laughs> I guess I trained you pretty well, huh? You did all right. I'm kind of busy here. We ever gonna visit the Head Assassins? I heard about this meeting place when I was younger. Apparently it exists, though I'm not sure, because I've never been. You'll get to see it once we have the apple. Well, I expect amazing things. A private espresso bar, for example. What a waste of money. You obviously aren't an espresso drinker. How did you manage to create a copy of the Animus? Ah, you know, Lucy sent me schematics. I thought she couldn't get anything out of Abstergo. She had her ways. I improvised on the rest. Huh.
Ezio's waiting. Yeah! 